Whoa! What the fuck? Right, come on, let's get up there. You ain't getting me, mate. You ain't getting me. Oh my god. She is one mega boss of a bitch. Yes, we finally got this bad boy unlocked. What's going on guys, it's myself Rothfuse and welcome back to part number 14 on Resident Evil Code Veronica guys. So, uh, in the last video we managed to come across with Wesker versus Alexia, apart from myself seeing the last um, bit of Steve when I was playing as Claire Redfield, but we're back to playing as Chris Redfield now. Right, we just gotta figure out what we gotta do next. So, just want to be in a hurry to try and get this um, game finished before I move on to start playing Resident Evil 3 Nemesis Remake. Which I cannot wait to get the hang of. We just got to put these wing objects in the box for now because we don't even need them just yet. Just to try and free up some space. We'll get that health pack out but we just put that green herb in there. So we'll have it on standby. Right. Okay, now let's go. Really appreciate for all of you joining in. Oh my goodness. Really not looking forward to it. I think we're gonna have to go up the lift to go onto the upper floor in the Antarctic base. Right, so there we go. Well, haven't been up this way for kind of like ages now. I even forgot what's in this room. We've got the square wheel now. Well, the square attachment that goes on the wheel. But we do need to attach it somewhere. Right, that's it. We've gone up here. Oh, doesn't even look good. There's a small square hollow. There's a notice you can drain the water under following conditions to clean a tank to exchange the water. So we're going to clean the tank then. Right, there we go. Right, we've drained all the water. We can actually get into the tank. Well, hoping it doesn't fill up again. Looks like that is some sort of key down there. Whoa! What the fuck? Oh my goodness! Right, come on, let's get up there. Freaking out! It's a bloody poisonous uh, hunter as well. Oh shit. Right, let's... Okay. Right, he's stuck down there. I better get the grenade launcher out. Oh my goodness. Come on, you bastard. Come on, you bastard. Okay, come on. That's it. Get down in there. Get down there. You freaking jerk. <laughs> my goodness, that scared me. Bloody hell, man. All of that just to get the crane key. This actually does happen. I forgot to say this might contain some bad language in the game. I'm not really looking forward to operating the crane. Because you know what's gonna come. This big ass tarantula. Whoa! Shit! Oh! Oh! Fucking hell! Please don't come back to life. Okay. What the hell? Whoa, shit. No. You ain't getting me, mate. You ain't getting me. Get lost. Whoa. God damn it. Jeez. Right, okay. Come on. You think you got what it takes? Right, time for the handgun now. I don't know if this is going to be any good or not. Would you quit? Stop. Pissing that green stuff on me. Okay. That wasn't much of an effort. 
Not as I thought it was. Apart from that, I've been poisoned. Jeez. Okay. What on earth is this? Take the Alexandra Pierce. So now we've got a green bit. We just gotta check it. Right, we've now removed it. Right, let's head back this way, shall we, guys? Right, so now we've gone back to the bit where we came from, so back to the basement floor of the Antarctic base. I think that's what we need to do is knock the power off so we can get the jewels out. I could be right or wrong, I don't know. Definitely can't go this way because it's locked. Right, what am I even doing? Hold on, we're supposed to go this way. Well, wow, what I hate about this bit, it's so confusing. It's just like you determine oh, which direction should you go to. Right, okay, there we go. It's a picture of the twins and the father. The weird holes open. They are at a boy's finger. Okay. Okay, so there's supposed to be a blue one that goes in as well. So we got the green one in, it's just getting the other two in. But we've got to find some way of... Um, No, I've gone the wrong way again. What am I even doing? See, this is what I hate about this. It's so confusing. Well, we're supposed to go this way and head to the room where Alexia was. Not Alexia, Ashford. Well, the other guy. Well, they're two in one. There is a button with the design. Push the button, guys. Right, okay, I think we've managed to figure out what the sequence of this puzzle is because this is another one of the hardest puzzles out of the Resident Evil game. So I'm here to show you guys. Right, just give me a sec, guys. Okay. As twins, Alexia and I are two sides of a coin. A design is carved under the name Alexia. There's a button with a design. Push the button. So I've got a feeling it's got to be this one first. And then the crown comes next. And then we got 
a heart, and then it's a spade. It appears I should put something in here. It means I've got to put the paperweight in that cabinet that's just open. Oh my god. What the hell? Okay. Jeez. Oh my goodness. What's he holding now? Take Alfred's ring. We just have to check it. Only way around this is to remove the jewel out of the actual frame itself. I think he's going to come back to life, I don't even know. Well, he's already dead. I wouldn't be surprised if he's come back to life. I don't know. Oh my goodness. Now we just gotta have to dig out the red one. There we go. I think we're on the right track, people. Right, we got the red one out of the storage box. But now we can go into the main hallway and place them into the slots where the staircase is. Right, this is the place I was on about just now. I think this is supposed to be a secret door. And then the blue one goes on the left. Well, I did say it was a secret door. Oh, frickin' hell. Come on, move it, you jerks. Don't you just give up with these zombies going all over the place. Move it! That's it, get off. Right, come on. Right. I know you're coming any closer, but you just only got to get blasted away. I think that would just do. Now we just got some more exploring to do then. Ah, another save room.
wow, somewhere nice and fancy, kind of posh from for being a hidden under base. What's in there? Oh, it's a key. It's a sterile room key. Okay. It's a portrait of a beautiful woman, the master of Ashford family, Veronica. Oh, got some herbs down there. Might as well just make some medicine. Well, that would just do fine. Okay, this room looks absolutely familiar. Okay, the music box lid is closed. The blue sapphire has been removed. Okay. Wow, that's supposed to be a secret door. It is as well. Well, I knew it was locked from the other side anyway. So we've managed to unlock this door. We haven't even been this way yet. Oh, it's a control room. Right, there's a book there. Oh, Code Veronica report. After many long years of research, I finally identified the inheritance element of administers the intelligence of a man. Right, we just need to check it. Right, a biohazard um, symbol is carved onto it. Well, that's another un door we unlocked. Right, now we're in the same place where Claire Redfield was. Claire? Is that you, Claire? Chris? No! The door won't open! Hey, is Steve with you? My god, another sad scene. Listen, Claire. We have to get out of here immediately. Can you unlock it from the inside? No, I can't. Chris, there should be a self-destruct system somewhere. If you activate it, all the electronic locks might be deactivated. <laughs> okay. We've taken a security file. We're coming up to the end of the game.
Right, okay. Right, something seems to be caught inside. Okay. Can we even open this? Okay. It's a card. A security card was among the, the files. Right, I believe this is going to be the last of the episode then. But sorry if I've been so quiet because uh, I wanted this to be the cinematic let's play. I've got a feeling there's some more ammunition on this side. Right, somewhere where we can place the shotgun. I wonder what's going to unlock. Oh, brilliant, we got some grenade rounds. Right, come on, get a grip. That's it, there we go. Right, we got some shotgun shells now. We just have to stick with the handgun. Wow. Well, let me know in the comments if you have enjoyed the series. Right, we're in the right place now. I think we need to unlock the door with the pure silver key. Right, we can now knock the power off because we don't need to have it turned on. Well, I just gotta say it's the best ending of the game while this is where all the action just comes into place. Right, that's the electricity off. But now we can go and remove those two jewels out of that tiger's head. Right, that's the red and the blue one we've taken. Right, then we're gonna head to the rooms where Alexia and 
I've forgotten his name now. Alfred. That's it. Move it. That's it. Bust into cornflakes. Don't come back. Come on, you jerk. These guys don't even know when to give up. Now we can just place these on top of the music box. And we just gotta place it into the blue one. Well, looks like we got a secret passage just opened. I'm not looking forward to this. No way. Mind you, this place looks absolutely familiar. To the one out of the very first Resident Evil looks like okay got plenty of supplies that we need This is what we need. The only thing we're missing is just a one wing. Well, there's nothing useful there. No chance. Get off! Don't think that's gonna do anything now. Right. Dragonfly object. We just need to find somewhere where we can find its fourth wing. I think that's the fourth wing object there. 
Okay, we can't open the cabinet with our bare hands. We just have to use the button on the panel. Right, there it is. Right, just as what we needed. We don't exactly need anything more down here. Just in case we'll, we accidentally die again, I'm just gonna hit the save once more. Right, we've made the folder gold uh, dragonfly now. That, that, there. We've got what we needed so we can actually go and hit save again. Right, now we've got the gold dragonfly we can insert it into the slot. Right, I think this is where the self-destruct system is. Move it, you blasted jerks. Come on. That's it. Bust into cornflakes again. Right. This is the one here. My god, there's so many gas canisters there. There's a terminal. Here's a release for the self-destruct system. Use the security card. Right, we know what the password is. It's Veronica, code Veronica. Done that one wrong. I think I've spelt Veronica right. Security code has been confirmed. Self destruction safety lock release has been released. Orders have been released in order to help the evacuation process. This facility will detonate in five. All doors are now unlocked. Not looking forward to it now. Right, this is the final showdown. Right, bust that one into cornflakes, man. Okay. Right, now we just gotta combine. We're fully stocked up on health now. Right, here comes the boss of a bitch now. You made it! Of course. Come on! Let's get out of here. Oh my goodness. 
Not looking good. Here she is. Here it is. She is one. She is one mega boss of a bitch. My God. Okay. Ale Alexia. Clockwise, simultaneously on three. Got it. Well, there she is now. This is the final showdown, guys. One. Two. Right, okay. She's definitely mutated now. I'll keep her busy. Just go for the emergency elevator. Chris, but I can take care of this. Just go. Okay, if you say so. You have to make it. Don't die on me. a bullet but now she's mutated even further freaking out she looks like a familiar creature out of dead space oh my goodness well it's a good job I kept the machine gun because I know it will be Handy for this one, guys, but just gotta say it's the last of the series. Mind you, it's one of the hardest bosses out of a Resident Evil game. Come on, Chris, you can do it. Stop throwing that stuff at me, Alexia. Not very nice. No way. All of that just to get the rocket launcher unlocked. I think that's about we've almost had it oh my god no way freaking hell she created all this my goodness whoa Yes, we finally got this bad boy unlocked. Well, you ain't gotta get away with it, bitch. Right, here we go. Right, what a blast. Uh, managed to bust into cornflakes now. That was absolutely insane. Phew. <laughs> Chris, uh, oh, you knew it. Claire, no. Wesker would be up to no good. I bet he was the one who created all this. What the fuck? Right, make a run for it, make a run for it, Chris. Make a run for it. Yep, that's it. Smash it through them doors. Chris! Well done, Chris. It turns out that Alexia's work wasn't much of anything. So now, the only thing left is revenge. Let her go, Wesker. You don't want her. Fine. Claire! Today's a good day. I came for Alexia, but killing you is even better. 
Sorry to disappoint you, but Alexia, it's gone. That's no longer a concern to me. I have Steve to work with. What? Steve. In his body, there's still a living T. Alexia virus. Steve should be a good specimen. Maybe he'll come back alive, just as I did, and be able to see your sister again. You freak! Don't you touch him! I'm sorry, dear heart. But my men have already taken him. You get out of here, Claire. But what about... As a surviving member of STARS, I have to finish this. Remember your promise. once and for all. Say hello to my comrades who you've killed. I don't know where you get your confidence, Chris. Right, Chris versus Wesker now. Oh my god. Ouch. 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 That's how strong he is. He's bent far. Self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel evacuate immediately. The self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel evacuate immediately. Wow, she's on the lookout for her brother, Chris Redfield. can do it, Chris. This guy is a traitor to stars. And I'm on about Albert sure, Wesker. I'm not human anymore. But just look at the power I've gained. Oh! Look at that. What a nice touch, Chris. Wow, that was good. He should have been the last boss of this game. I think Wesker is the last boss of uh, was one of the Resident Evil games. I think it's number five. Bloody hell, that didn't work either. Stuff always you. Today's your lucky day. Next time we meet, don't count on another. Next time. Until we meet again. <laughs> Well, you ain't getting far on this one, Wesker. Right, guys. That is the end of the Resident Evil Code Veronica Let's Play series. And I hope you all enjoyed. So if you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe. Chris, where are you?
Oh shit. Hey. You know Just that I always time. keep my promises. <laughs> Chris, promise me. Please promise that you won't leave me alone again. I'm sorry, Claire, but it's not over yet. There's still something we've got to do. You mean... Yeah, it's payback time. We've got to destroy Umbrella. Now, let's finish this once and for all.